everyone, Sigmalator here. Welcome back to Horizon Zero Dawn. Right, I'm not sure what's going on there. Right, where are we off to? Search the Banuk camp. Okay. Can't do anything with that. Camp is surrounded by docile machines. What could be the cause? One of the fallen. No, I can't do these ones yet. All right, fair enough. There's somewhere around here I can fast travel to. There's a metal flower around there. Right, this is the closest I can get. Really? Vantage. <coughs> oh, excuse me. Hay fever's a bitch. Here we go. So we're going to have to do some travelling by foot, but we're a lot closer than we were before. Take all the things you're willing to provide. I'm sure this is all useful for something. A shell walker. Take all that, thank you. Let those shell walkers get on with whatever it is they're doing. You saw nothing. horns. Right, don't need to worry, don't need to concern myself with them. Yeah, we we'll just let them get on with their day.
What are those shell walkers about, I wonder? You have fatty meat, I require it. Oh, I have plenty of fatty meat, okay. You know what? It's not worth it. You 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 just carry on with it your day. I was that low on ammo. You don't need to worry about me, just you just keep doing whatever it is you're doing. They don't seem too bothered by me, that's something I guess. Oh, hello. Well, at least they're friendly. This has to be the Banuke camp the building told me about. So what happened to the other mercenaries he sent? The machines are docile. It's like they've already been overridden. They probably have. You're not the only one with the... <coughs> excuse me. With the skill. Who am I talking to? Well, good for you. Are you the one I need to talk to? To see these machines up close like this, it's grazer dung. I'm sorry? Frozen grazer dung. This ravager led me here. I chased it down from the rivals where it killed a great ice hunter, tore him in two. The challenge I accepted. But when it reached this camp, the fury left it. 
Isn't that a good thing? Takuk says it's a gift. Pfft. What is a gift but a reward that you didn't earn? The machines are meant to challenge us. Now I'm stuck here guarding the shamans. All right. Forget about traveling light. Gotta be somewhat. Who's the head honcho here? Is it you? Shaman, you're trying to understand the machines here too? Yes, Nora. And taking my time with my studies. Between you, me, and the spirits, I appreciate the peace. Not just from the machines. There are many changes in Ban Ur. The hunters and shamans bicker without end. What about? How best to deal with a harsher world? The hunters, they don't want it back the way it used to be. And we shamans find ourselves able to explain less and less. So many are exiles now, sent to wander. Here, no one argues. So, I welcome mystery. All right then. There's someone up here I need to talk to. Ah, you look official. Tomorrow we'll see what the shamans have learned from the machine spirits. All right. Snow's got a bite out here. I think I'm going the right way, I'm not entirely sure. Did Vilgan send you? Hmm. I guess shards can buy a conscience. Never mind that. Nora, girl, you have to stop the others. Up ahead, we snuck up here, uncovered some kind of ancient device, plain as an anvil. That's what affects the machines. The other bungheads voted to take it to Pitchcliff for auction. But it's taken a beating already. Like it dropped from the sky. But we tried to stop them digging it out. Without that thing up here, those Banuk will be massacred. I'll stop them. You two get out of here. It seems like they've done enough damage. Well, that's a fair appraisal. <laughs> Alright, cool. I am going the right way. Thank you for leaving me with, the su with supplies. I'm sure they will be handy. What have you done? Who are you? You're not one of those Banuk. <sighs> Too late. Let me look at it. Hold on, hold on. This was our delve. We did the work. You want to put your axe in? What's this thing worth to you? I don't know about this. 
This was your idea. You started it, you can finish. All right. Could be this thing's just scrap, but even scrap has a price. So I'll ask again, what's it worth to you? It's worth more to me than you are. You still want to negotiate? Forget it. All you've ever given me is black toes. <sighs> They've made a mess of this. Catastrophic malfunction. This is from long ago. And it's been sending a signal all this time. Fading out. I have to get back to the camp before the machines tear it apart. All right, okay. Uh -oh, the birds are gone. No, they've already started attacking. The hunt is back. Oh shit. Defend the camp. Do it for us. Yes. Roar and rend at me. Can I don't fear there? it. Now you'll hear my song, machine. A sharp song. Shit. Stay still. The hunt is back. Shit. this change would come upon us not exactly although i know there is a lot changing in our world this time it was outsiders those asaram thought the asaram do not think they will never understand the balance between us between man and machine now the blue light has gone and we are left with many songs but more for mourning than gratitude so what now? Will you go back to your homeland? When we teach the young to walk on shifting ice, we say, the secret is taking one step, then the next. Perhaps one day, we will understand the machine's mysteries. I hope so. Good luck, Teacook. All right. I probably should uh, be investigating more of the uh, caves to build up uh, Aloy's understanding of the machines and exactly what caused this world to collapse in the first place. Okay, I've got a metal flower over there. Devil Thirst and all that. Uh. Uh, I need to clear up uh, corrupted over there. There go ruins. And that's what I've already done though, so I need to discover more. Jesus, there's a lot.
ancient vestimental flower. I've got all these to collect as well, an advantage there. So let's. Uh. What? You said I can't. You said I had fatty meat. Why wouldn't you let me pick it up if you said I had. Oh. Return to Vilgund. Right, is there a merchant round here? There is. Hello. Uh, all right, so I need to sell some resources. Okay. So now I should be able to buy some of these. All right, that will do. Can I get anything else here? No. Right, weapons. All right, I think we're good. Right. Oops. So I'll travel over here, see what this vantage is, pick up some of these side bits and pieces. I might collect these things sort of off screen, just to get them out of the way and focus mainly on the story side of things for the playthrough. That might be the way to go. But first... We'll, we'll finish off this episode with uh, some side bits and pieces. Oh, the vantage is up there. Interesting. I get it now. A vantage point. More ruins, more stories. Ah, here we go. Okay, so we've got that one. 
Let's head over there now and grab this metal flower. I did make a whole bunch of arrows, so this grabs as much of this as we can. Oh, good, a corrupted. Where are you going? Calm, calm. Damn it. Shit. No, don't swim. What are you doing? There we go. Whew. Oh. All right then. Ah, here we go. Another metal flower. You're a question waiting for an answer. God, I've got loads of those to collect. Jesus. Okay, we've got that. I'll cut it. Oh, yeah, I'll cut the rest of these off screen because I don't think it'll be a very interesting playthrough if it's just me going around all the collecting all these bits and pieces because really it's the story we're most interested in. So I'll do those off screen and focus on the story for the playthrough. Let's head over here. I'm not going to waste a fast travel for the campfire. <laughs> You're safe now. Sure. And with that in mind, I'm going to end this episode here because it's a million degrees in here and I need to put my aircon on for a bit. Thank you very much for taking the time to watch this, guys. If you liked it, like, subscribe, ding that bell. I'll be Sigma later. This has been Horizon Zero Dawn, and I'll catch you next time. Take care now.